going on everybody? Doyle here from Premier RV out in Bluegrass, Iowa. Today, I got a great one for you guys. I'm standing right inside the new Brinkley Model Z 3400. This rear deck or rear patio floor plan is amazing and super innovative. So let's get right into it. Stepping inside to the living room. Beautiful craftsmanship all around. You see this rear wall put to great use. You got your fridge, overhead storage, and a large pantry with adjustable shelving. That door right there is going to lead to your patio. And you got the kitchen, three burner cooktop, microwave, and oven and tons of storage all around. You got your island with the all black sink and the high rise kitchen faucet and all gold with the pull down sprayer. Tons of storage here as well. And here you got your two garbage bins and your paper towel holder. Outlets there. Of course, the Brinkley Signature Dog Bowls. Over here, 5,000 BTU fireplace. Large smart TV. And over here, you're going to find your sofa. Pulls out into a bed. Different design than the typical RV sofa. And it's got a different and better feel to it, in my opinion. Mirror there. And lots and lots of more storage. As you see, the theme for this one is storage. Theater seating here. And you got the Brinkley Signature, I'm not sure what it's actually called, but the L table. And I will paste in a video of me talking about it right now. So this is the initial position that it comes in. This one is number one, the breakfast nook. And we're going to want to go to position number two, which is the right L desk position. To do this, we're going to get under. Pull this out. Push that in. And you can kind of adjust it from there, how far out you want it. We're going to put the chair here. So then we're going to want to go from here to position number three, which is the center dining position. So to do that, there's a lever under here that we're going to pull. And we're going to pull that to the middle. One chair on each side. This is going to give you that center dining position. So we want to go to the last one, number four, which is the center desk position. Pretty much how we started, just moved over. This one's a little bit different. It's got some bottle holders there. It's also got some silverware storage here. And you got a little ottoman here. Place that wherever. Likely in front of the couch, but. Again, that door leads to the patio, so let's check it out. Walking outside through the tinted patio door you're going to see the zero gravity rear patio with the electric top latches. It's got a residential style wire patio railing. And then you see this awesome rear deck area. It's got a 50 inch smart TV, 
on a swivel mount. It's got tons of cabinet storage. It's a trash can right there. One 10 volt, four and a half cubic foot refrigerator. Got more storage up there. It's got a large work surface as well. And it's got a bar sink. As well as this awesome sound system right here for playing tunes in the summertime. Got a door for some access. This one is just incredible. Now heading up to the bedroom bathroom area. But first, we'll stop and check out this little additional closet. And of course, there's your control panel, battery monitor, and the Max Air fan control. And we'll step into the bedroom, king sized bed. You got the lights back there to set the mood, window on each side, and you got some USB ports up there. And down here is where you got your outlets. You also have some spacious underbed storage, and that's gas strut, so they stay up on their own. Got another TV right there. Dresser here. And right here. Washer dryer prep. Some little storage or whatever there. There's where the dryer would go. If not, can just be used as more storage. And here is the wardrobe closet. Of course, you got the big mirror. And you got lots of space in here. There's your cordless vacuum prep. Got the outlet there. Super bright lights so you can see. And you got some shelving there. Heading into the bathroom now. Here's your large shower. It's the glass door right there. Those are metal too, those holders. And there's your shower head. Super big mirror. Pretty crazy, scared myself when I first walked in and looked at myself. Large counter space with the outlet. You got three drawers underneath. And then you got storage under the sink there. Toilet paper holder, two towel hooks, porcelain toilet, and some more storage for all your toiletries and whatnot. There you got access to your gas water heater. Now let's take a look outside. We'll just briefly go over the outside. We'll have a full owner's guide video coming soon. There's Brinkley's signature steps and handrail for the entrance. For tires, it's got 17 and a half inch H rated Cooper tires. And it's got heavy duty 8K axles with 8K leaf springs. Super spacious pass-through storage here it is on the door side your shower right there tons of space and right here is where you're going to find your lp tank one on each side there's a look at your pin box that comes with it and that beautiful brinkley front cap here we got the front storage got your battery disconnect and your 50 amp mppt solar controller for the 370 watt solar panel on the roof prep for an inverter and lithium ready as well and here is your utility center at the top you can see gray tank and black tank valves and at the bottom you'll see the 65 inch retractable hose for city water over to the electronic leveling there's your controls right there and down here is where we're going to find two of our leveling jacks. Over here is where we're going to find that 
outdoor door access to get into that rear deck patio area. And there's where you can put the retractable ladder since obviously you're not putting one on the back. Here's your patio door. We're going to put the patio down at the top, rear backup camera and at the bottom. You got your two inch receiver. And that's going to wrap this one up. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you want to learn more about this unit or other units we have in stock, check out our website, premierrv.com, or use the contact info in the description to get a hold of us. Thanks for watching, everybody. And as always, make sure you like and subscribe and comment and let me know what you think of this floor plan. Thanks for watching, everybody. Happy camping.